Yeah, what up, Detroit? Nuh uh, nuh uh, nuh, no, he didn't. Uh -huh. They didn't do it again. Need to replace this, get this out of here. Just because it's old. What's happening, everybody? This is your boy Smitty from DetroitMountsu.com, ready to give you my review on the Lions 41 44 loss to the Tennessee Titans. Crazy game in overtime. Your boy Sean Hill had to finish the game, threw a duck to Calvin Johnson to get him down the field. Didn't get the good penetration that he needed on an early snap from Dominic Rayola. We starting off slow as far as the offense is concerned. Matthew Stafford cannot get it going. I want to clown everybody who doubted me about my prediction about Michael LaShour. I predicted 18 carries for, I think it was 97 yards. He had 26 for 100. Do I agree with the play at the end? Yeah. I mean... It's not a bad play. You just need to execute. Everybody's clowning, talking about give the ball to LaShore, give the ball to Bell. I don't care. This is a football game. Execute. You know, it's a couple of things that are blaring holes. I talked about special teams last season, and I talked about it in the preseason. They gave up the long touchdown after an excellent drive by Matthew Stafford and company. And, you know, that really tilted the game because the Lions had plenty of momentum and came back down the field again and wind up throwing the ball to Brandon Pettigrew, who, I don't even know what you call it, a fumble or a steal? Really? Really, dog? This is part of the reason that I wanted Ryan Broyles to play. I mean, to be honest with you, you drafted this cast second overall. Regardless of who out there wants to disagree with the picks, dude needs to play. The only play I saw Broyles in on was the touchdown that Sean Hill threw for Hail Mary to Titus Young. That's the only time I saw him all game. I think it's not that Pettigrew can't play. He's a blocking tight end. I'm seeing too much of him. Put Broyles in the game. He will cause mismatches. Back to the special teams, man. The Music City Miracle. You know, that type of stuff gets a team that's not good. That gets them going. You know, for a team like that to put up 44 points on you, even though it was an overtime, seriously, you going to let that happen? Because you get the offense clicking. And that crazy play by Jacob Lacey tells me that you know, not drafting a corner, which was what I wanted. And I've sided with the taking the best player available thing to all these clowns who have been talking about Jeff Beck is this, Jeff Beck is that. Get over it. We shouldn't have drafted Riley Reeve. We should have took Janoris Jenkins. Point period to end. You want a tackle that's not playing in this game. And your wide receiver's not getting any snaps. We missed Tony Scheffler. Yeah, Will Heller dropped the pass, but, you know, Let's accept some of these guys for who they are and what they do. When you have talent, call some mismatches. I don't like the play calling. Defenses are playing the Lions deep. I'm talking about 20, 15 to 20 yards deep minimum. All this green grass, everybody clowning about the check down. Let's just be honest. You got to take what the defense gives you. Dump the ball to LaShore, Jock Bell, whoever. You got Jason Hansen who's kicking plenty of field goals to keep you in the game. If Baronis don't miss all them field goals, the Lions may not be in this game. I mean, I look, I'm looking at coaching right now. Why are you playing games with the Tennessee Titans? Coaching is becoming an issue right now. You can't get your quarterback rolling. You can't get your big-time receiver the ball until halfway through the game. Your special teams is playing terrible, and your defensive line is not doing their job. You can't get to Jake Locker. You're making him look like an all-pro. Yo, I'm Smitty from DetroitMarathon.com. Make sure y'all check out the Monday Madness show that we'll be talking about. Everybody from the Michigan Wolverines, the Spartans, and these crazy Detroit Lions. We may even throw some Tigers in there. So follow us on Twitter, like the Facebook fan page, and make sure you subscribe to this YouTube channel.